I'm going to ask you a very simple question. It seems simple, but it's not. This is a very common misconception that I notice. Is that vertical bone loss? If you think so, you are wrong. Definitely you are wrong. If your answer is false, you got the right answer. Why? Why is that? Because we miss an important principle to determine if, the, if you have either horizontal bone loss or vertical bone loss, your reference is, the, is, is that, the, the cemento enamel junction between adjacent teeth. In this case, if we draw an imaginary line between this one and this one, you will notice the alveolar crest is parallel to that line. So that, this is normal condition. This is normal finding. We did not have bone loss in this case. What happened in this case is that we are familiar uh, or we always see the bone crest is parallel to the cruzal surface. So if we see this case, we know this is a normal, a normal a normal finding. But if this tooth over erupts, it will bring the alveolar bone occlusally. So that the alveolar bone, in this case, it is more occlusally. So that it looks, it looks like a vertical bone loss. But it's not. The over eruption, over eruption of this tooth makes the alveolar bone like that. I hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, if you have any questions, just write it down I, and I will be pleased to answer them. If you need more information, I really recommend you to read this book, Fermin Karanza. Thank you.